Hi, it's Frances Cole Jones, author of How to Wow and creator of the app Interview Wow. I'm gonna talk about the three things you should know right now if you're going out looking for a job because there are a few tricky places uh, that you're gonna be bumping into. Number one, I need you to have the answer to tell me about yourself. All right, the answer to tell me about yourself is not to talk about yourself, just FYI. This is not an opportunity to get into, like I grew up here and I went to school here, no one cares. The answer to tell me about yourself is, this is how I'm going to add value to your company once you hire me, all right? So you need to have researched the company. You need to look at it and say, you know, I noticed that you're looking for someone who could do X and Y. I can do X and Y and I can also do Z. That is the answer to tell me about yourself. One tricky thing that is going on right now with HR people, what I understand they're doing is they're stopping job interviews halfway through and they are saying, you know what, we just don't think you're right for us. This is not because you are not right for them. They are just doing this to see if you're gonna fight for the job. All right, what they tell me is about half the people they talk to at that point say, well, you know, I didn't really think I was right for this, but I thought I'd come in. All right, that's not your answer. When someone says to you, you know what, we just don't think you're right for us, your answer to that is, well, I guess I might not, must not have been making myself clear. I really do want this position. Why don't you let me take you through my thinking one more time, okay? We don't think you're right for us. It's an opportunity to fight for something. And finally, I was talking the other day to a gentleman who does a lot of hiring for sales positions. And his rule of thumb is he will not call you back until you have called him three times. Because what he says is, if you can't take rejection in the interview process, you are not gonna be a good salesperson. So if you are applying for a sales job, you can keep calling back and keep calling back and keep calling back, because guess what? That's what they're looking for. That's what they want you to do. In general, for other positions, if you've tried to get in touch with people and you haven't heard back from them and I know you're frustrated and it's very upsetting, I highly recommend keeping a sense of humor. If you call, leave a lighthearted message. Hey, you know, this is so-and-so and I just wanted to check in about the interview I had the other day. What you don't want to do is sound stressed or angry, okay? You don't, people don't call people back who make them feel like they're in trouble. I hope all this is helpful. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to get in touch.